Look, are you going to come and look interested in your calendar? Look. Look. Look, are you going to come and show your calendar to all your fans? Oui. Oh, obviously not. He's discovered you can't eat it and you can't play with it. So he's not interested. So I'll have to show you about him. What? What's in there? Look. You can open it. You're going to show them. Hmm? You're going to show them what you got. I'm going to have to do it on the table. Right, there we are. Oops, looks calendar. We've got a pile of them there, look. And... I'm not going to show you them all, because that would spoil the surprise, wouldn't it? So, flick through a few pages. Which I can't do because my there's a few pages just to there you go so it's um it's A4 I'm really pleased with it because the colours have come up really nice the greens are not overly green and the tongue the pinks are nice colour as well because sometimes they make them bright green and gaudy and the tongue looks like raw meat and horrible but uh, they've done them very nicely, very pleased with them. But shout out a month, pick a month. Pick a month. Yeah. June. I'll show you June. There's June. There you are, you can see Nook, Cane and Bray. And Nook, of course. Right, shout out another month. April. April, now on. January, April. There we go. And that's April and that's all I'm going to show you. So you'll have to hopefully buy one yourselves to find out what the rest of it is like. Um, I don't know what to say, the postage, oops, postal rates, took it to the post office yesterday in its cardboard packet and sleeve and weighed it. And the lady very kindly told me what the charges would be. But they didn't actually tally with what's in the, the leaflet. But it looks like Europe is... Oh, I haven't told you, the, the calendar itself works out at £8.50. So they're £8.50 each. Um, and the postal charges for Europe is £4.25 in... Great British pounds, of course. Whoops. Um, UK is one pound eighty-three first, and second is one fifty-three, and that includes Northern Ireland. The Europe includes Southern Ireland. Now, where she went wrong is the world. The world is divided up into zones for postal reasons, and Zone Three. She said is US, Australia, Canada and China and whatnot and everything else that isn't in Europe. But the leaflet says differently. So Australia is the only one, I think, that is in Zone 1. If I can find it. Hold on. International trapped and all that. Pricing zones. International standard. Now, I don't know if you can see much of it on there. It. So we're down here, large letter, um, Europe 425, she got that right. World Zone 1 isn't much different from World Zone 3. Now Australia is World Zone 2, which makes the postage £6.80. But there's only 15p between the two, so uh, perhaps that's what she was saying. So... Everywhere else is five pounds eighty five for oops for um postage. There's the little diagram, which is very confusing because they use similar colours, but there's Australia down there, 
So that is World Zone 2. Is that what I said just now? But that's World Zone 2. And it seems to be the only one. That is the US, America, which is Zone 3. So America is the only one, US is the only one in Zone 3. The rest of it there is, is Europe. Um, yeah, we got that sorted. But World Zone 1 is, is all the rest of it. But it's, like I say, there's only a 15p difference. So it doesn't really make that much difference. But I'll write all this up on the on the uh, in the in the description or somewhere or other so you can see it all. Nook is still being very interested in it. Not even gonna pose so so that's it. There you are another flick through and you can see <laughs> I'm privileged to own a Sherpa book. So if anybody hasn't seen Sherpa book yet, I expect everybody's seen it, just pop over to Jane's channel and have a look because he's got a video on his new Sherpa book. He's become famous as an author amongst everything else. So there you go. I think that's it. Um, I hope you'll all want one. There's the pile there. So we've got quite a few. So thank you very much for looking. And are you going to say thank you for looking? Oi. Oi. Useless, useless. This is a husky, full of energy, raring to go. <laughs> You're looking more interested now, aren't you? She's got his poppy on. Oh, maybe he's not interested. <laughs>